Well, we have the most perfect day for you. A warm hello in every sense of the word. The sun is out and football has a special place on this most idyllic of days. A fixture ahead of us to which we've all been looking forward for so very, very long and it means so very, very much. The scene could not be more beautiful. The pitch looks terrific. The players are ready to get started and we cannot wait for the contest that lies ahead. This place simply a monument to the game. So much prestige, so much pride, so much passion whenever football is played here. It appears to be a 4-4-2 formation, Jim. I think it gets a, a terrible raw deal these days. It's deemed old-fashioned, outdated, but in truth, with the, the right personnel, it works just as well as, as any other system or formation. Success can still be had with it, and teams are still winning big trophies with exactly this setup. We have already started here. And the weighted pass. Goalkeeper's ball. Decent looking ball. Well read, he sorted that out. Uh, he acknowledges that he should have come up with something better there. Yeah, I mean, he, I think he did well to, to spot the run. He just didn't get enough behind it. It happens. Tries to get it forward quickly. Well weighted. It's found the tries a shot! He's delivered all right! And looking back at that, that's how you play on the counter. Quick and decisive and ruthless with the finish. I thought it was a stunning, stunning breakaway. Deadlock broken, it's 1-0. Yeah, and they know there's plenty of work left in this one, Peter, before they can actually say that the job is over. Hardly anything between the sides, and the score is 1-0. A great gallop down the right hand side. Oh, shooting chance! In it goes! All too easy! They are in danger of disappearing out of sight. It is a good finish. The odds were against him. Little matter. Well, I think that defence there thought they were in good position and they had him where they wanted, yet somehow he's worked the scoring position when it didn't see him on. It's really crafty business, that. So that's two now without reply. The turning of the screw comes to mind, Peter. They've got them where they want them. Whistle's gone, that's a foul.
hoists it forward. Gets on, shapes the shoot! Oh, good ball. He's had a shot! And that's it for the first half. A breathless ending. Any opinion you'd like to express on the first half? Well, it's looking pretty straightforward, Peter. They've got themselves into a, a very good position, so why do they from here when they can repeat their first half success with a, another show of strength? It has been a remarkable contest, decorated by goals, and two between them at half time. We're probably into the second 45 minutes. There were better options before the ball was lost. Easy to save from up here, I know. And it's played forward. Forward it goes. Right now, what's on? And he heaves it forward. Great strength, too strong for his opponent. Loose ball, who's going to get that? I think that's offside. Yes, it is. Well, there is some activity down on the touchline. It seems there's going to be a change. Keeper sends it forward. Well, that looks a foul. Yep, referee's given it. position to make that interception just brushed off the ball there Richardson to get it forward quickly. He's made sure that that won't get through. Hoists it forward. be two minutes and the shot oh, attempt just the wrong outcome that's a little unfortunate he had a lot of people worried then time for a change in personnel well he's worked so hard for his side uh, as you would expect but you couldn't help notice that he was stuck that is it, the referee has seen it up. A decent win via a very competent performance. Without doubt they were the better side, and the result reflects as much. How do you sum up what we've witnessed, Jim? Of course, we all love to watch the creative side of the game and goal scorers, but there's an art to good defence too, and their organisation and discipline has helped earn this win. I think we're just about out of time, so many thanks to Jim, and a very good afternoon to you.